What is happening Continue. right now? <laughs> you got us too drunk. I didn't do anything. It was all you. Yummy, yummy in my tummy. Welcome to the couch. I hope everybody's having a great day. It's shitty out. So we should go to the movies and get some booze into our bellies. Coming up, I have two amazing people that I think are very funny and I think that you will find them very funny as well. What else to talk about other than that? Guys, anything I should touch upon? I don't think you need to hear me talk anymore. I think we should just get right into this and have just a blast. One is tall, one is not. Give it up for Brad and Allie! Yeah! Yeah! Not tall! Oh, God. A seat, guys. My torso. Ugh. Get him in there. Cheers. 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 Mm, Bailey's mm. and coffee. Mm. So you two. Us. The two of you. Let me just you. say it. I'm terrified about what movie you're gonna choose. Oh, yeah. you already <laughs> want to get into that? Eh? No, we don't have to. We can stretch it out. I'm we'll just... stretch it out. We're okay. gonna pat it out with some light chit chat. Oh, light right. chit chat. Let's start okay. with Allie. Let's start heavy. Are you a big movie buff? Um, I I don't know. Maybe. I, like, I, I don't think I'd ever call myself a movie buff, yeah. but I, I like to watch... Bradley! Hi, buddy. Can I call you Bradley? I prefer you didn't, but I'm okay with it. Okay. Feels right. You a movie buff? You like the movies? I actually used to work at a video store. Oh! oh do you know what that is? Do you know what that is? Do you know what that is? <laughs> oh, I know uh, what a video store is. Hey, Brad, uh, what video store did you work at? I did work for the major chain that is known as Blockbuster. Oh, oh Mark wow. Rogers Video Gal over here. All right. Nice uh, video 99 for me. Ooh, okay. So this is a problem you guys probably didn't have at your video stores, but inevitably is you would get, you know, 12, 25 copies of the hit movie and then one or two French copies. Oh. And honest to God, I don't know how many times where I would have a conversation with somebody of, this is the French one, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the French, like you, I know there's no more copies of Escape from LA, but this, <laughs> if you want this one, it's in French, whatever. Hey, this is French. I know yeah. you're such a, okay, well. I'm well. I think the the moral of the story is that people have always been idiots. Oh, yeah, yeah. 100%. Oh, certainly. I'm really excited for this one because it is you okay. Uh, I'm so breath. nervous. I don't even know. I don't even look at what's in theaters. Well, it's a first for Drunk Movie Day because we're going to go see like an actual big movie. What? A big movie that's probably going to suck a lot of shit. Sure. All right. We're going to go see Justice League, guys. Yeah. Oh, boy. I need an excuse to hate this movie. Yeah. Okay. Do it. Yeah. Uh, there's going to be at least one like quippy line on the part of Cyborg of yeah. being more man than machine. There'll definitely be a part where probably Aquaman will be like, are you machine everywhere? And yeah. like, wink, wink. And like, because he's talking about his penis. His penis. Yeah. There will be cameos from comic book uh, characters that I have no idea who they oh, are. Sure. But there'll be a guy in the theater when they show up go, Oh my god, that's shit. Yeah. The guy from the books on the screen. The Bada Bird. Hey. Anna him. Anna. Uh, 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 uh. I'm right here. Stop <laughs> doing that. <laughs> to to Justin. Yeah. God, fuck. It's not noon yet, Kyle. Oh, yeah. Hey, look. Well, yet, Kyle. Oh, yeah. Justice League. Let's go! Woo! Ah. Woo! Oh. Shake away the bad feelings, my friend. Come together! Yeah. Wait, did I say that? Right now! Over oh, me! Looks like blue water. Oh! We are back from a terrible oh, movie. Oh, so bad! If you oh. cut the exposition out of that movie, it's 17 minutes long. Mm -hmm. 17 minutes of CGI. 17 minutes bad. of CGI characters. See? Bashing into each other and then looking at each other with a knowing wink and going, "Oh yeah." Fuck you. I'm gonna kick things off, you two. Mm -hmm. Let's right. get into it. The biggest thing out of the way, and that is Superman's upper lip. Wow. <sighs> he was shooting a different movie when they did reshoots, yes. and he had to have a mustache, so they edited it out with some of the most lackluster CGI enhancements mm -hmm. I've ever mm -hmm. seen. Real thin lips. A thin lip. 
Like, I get it. also started with a quote. So it had like a, you know, a cell phone video of Superman. He was like, hopes like when you lose. My dad used to always say, hopes like when you lose your car keys, you know. They're easy to lose, but when you rummage around, you can usually find them. Do you ever rummage around for hope, you two? Yeah. Always. Oh, man. Well, always again, rummaging. I'm... Honey, where's my hope? Is it like my car keys? Honey, where's... Uh, why are they in the freezer? Why is my hope in the freezer? Yeah. Why does the fob on my hope cost $400 <laughs> to replace? <laughs> my first thought when we saw the first Batman scene was like, I, was like, I feel like the person who made this this superhero movie was like, it was like me making it. like, hey, well, just like, Ali, just like, do what you kind of know from a superhero movie. So the first scene will be Batman on a rooftop and he'll be like surprising people and like. At the end of the day, I really feel like this movie was bad. Bad. Yes. <laughs> yes. Hey, can, can I do this? And then just the the person who the ran line. the whole show was like, yeah, do yeah, whatever the fuck you know. want, man. They gave us $200 million. Just do whatever the fuck you want. I'm like, should we do it well? I don't fucking care. Let's talk about the jacked Amazonian women, though. That was pretty great. They were badass. Okay. That was actually... Uh, okay, that many women living on one island. There is no way... There's number like one, that worked. that's how they fucking dress when there's just all the women. Okay, number what would they be wearing? Okay, normally? number one. Okay, if no one's gonna be attacking them, they're wearing uh, sweatpants or nothing. I'm sorry, they're not wearing metal armor. Have you heard I... the fact that no women take off their bras as soon as no one else is there? So there's no way they're wearing metal bras when it's just all women. Ellie, and Ellie. no, so it's either nothing or loose t-shirt. Like a t-shirt then... they got from Six Flags. Yes, that's too big from for Six Flags. them. Or. They're wearing full fucking armor that will actually protect them. Oh my god, all these Amazonians would either be wearing full armor or a t-shirt. <laughs> Come together! Right now. So glad it's not that bright. Oh! Oh, mm. the bit. <sighs> mm. So, the three of us work at the special effects company, okay? okay. Hey guys, so uh, Justice League is coming out in two weeks. Um, oh. Like, you guys are all done with CGI, right? Uh, mostly. Um, yeah, no, we're just working through um, another word direct from Wait, the film. Wait, are Mother you drinking right now? Boxes. Shut up, it's CGI. Mother. Guys, I feel the like children's you, game. Guys, I feel like you didn't finish the CGI. Yes, we didn't. Wait. <laughs> CGY. Well, we're it's, union, so. It's gonna be fine. <laughs> This movie had the problem of uh, movies that I hate, like Star Wars Episode Two, where it feels like your older brother's playing a video game and they won't let you play. Yeah, and also it sucked. It was like it was like an overcomplicated plot line for a movie that's just like, guess what? The bad guy's bad. Superman! Guess what? The bad guy's bad! We wanna beat him so bad! Superman's here! Superman! Yarl! So I'll play Batman. Okay. Mm -hmm. You play Wonder Woman. Oh, fuck yeah. And you play Aquaman Flash. I love it. Whatever you want. I'm playing Ben Affleck playing Batman. Okay. We need to get this team together. Yes, we do. I don't know about this. You dress like a bat. Help me. Get me out of this fucking movie. I'd rather be anywhere but here. Oh, God, what have I done? Why did I sign this multi-year contract? So anyways, we should probably bring Superman back to life. Um, you want a drunken movie day, you got that's drunken not, movie you got day. It. Okay, so here's my biggest takeaway from this movie, and also from the movie Dunkirk, uh, Christopher Nolan movie. Wait, you're gonna tie did. these yeah, two together? Yeah, yeah, I'm tying them together. Where the fuck do all these sailors get their fucking amazing sweaters from? Because in Dunkirk, the whole time, I was like, yeah, World War II, but also I was like, where did these British sailors... Did you just put World War II in quotes? Mm -hmm. She doesn't believe it exists. I don't believe it. <laughs> Are you a World War II denier? No, my little brother can't. But also, I do appreciate the sacrifice. Well, I know what you're saying is true. Remember, he's also an or a member of the Order of the Phoenix. Also, look at that picture of his Also, face. what is this like this? I'm debating getting one right now. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Um, yeah. So oh, this fucking movie! Uh, hey, how's your Harry Potter podcast going? I don't have one. Harry Podcast? I would love to have one. Somebody please fund that. <laughs>
<laughs> Is everybody really okay? You're I'm touching fine. the poorest guys in town. <laughs> yeah. Somebody funded. I'm going to start a Harry Potter podcast. It's Harry insane. Podcast. That was, that was so the weird. The thing I feel happy about is I know that Kyle's going to cut out my Harry Potter podcast. We all know. A great thing that people do in movies like this is where there is a bunch of uh, immortal superheroes, and whenever there's cops involved, they're always guns drawn, even though they know the superheroes cannot be killed. Which was also mirrored in the Amazon scene, where in a box that is clearly containing superhero powers, there have been Amazonian women with their <laughs> arrows just trained on it for the entire time. Hey, Lisa, how's the uh, how's the job going where you aim an arrow at a box? Oh, well, you know, it's uh, my arm's starting to cramp up, but, you know, good benefit. Mm, so my biggest beef on this movie is that... Hot uh, beef. Here we go. Beef. Okay, number one is that... Fuck, I have so many beasts in this movie, but um, basically, number one is that some people's time has been brought up by it. Like, uh, Amy Adams, Amber Heard, uh, Joel Dado, uh, they all could have been doing different fucking things while this movie's being filmed. It took all their time up. Final thoughts was, uh, Brian, you go first. <laughs> Oh, finally, the guy who I thought was going to commandeer this. It was gets, me. I'm finally getting <laughs> I'm the... I'm terrified of you now. Thank I am you. finally getting the Lady Bing trophy. It was two hours designed around characters that nobody thought, will anybody care about any of these people? And we just mm -hmm. don't. No, I don't like any of them. Now this is pod racing. Guys, if you're watching this, we're all women. Um, and Justice, Justice League is obviously a horrible example of a woman. Hello, can somebody please mention the fact that we're the only women here? A bunch of dudes fought over boring shit about an alien, and I was like, wow, imagine if all these actors had put time into doing something, literally anything else. So you liked it? I hated it. Okay. See you next time. I didn't love it either. Shut up, Brad. You're right.